Uh, it's getting a little warm out there. I had to take the jacket off. But right now, let's head up north to Prescott and see how the Heritage Park Zoology and Sanctuary is celebrating their 35th anniversary with Miss Diane. How are you this morning? Great. Ah! How are you? Oh my. Oh. <laughs> Max <laughs> has to put his two cents in as well. I know. Who do we have there? So this is Max. He's a blue and gold macaw. He's a uh, he's about 32, so he's almost as old as we're celebrating our 35th anniversary. Oh my goodness! And there's a lot planned, which is kind of cool with them, uh, as we of course love coming up to the sanctuary and how important it is to our community. Uh, the funny thing is, does Arizona actually have uh, the macaws as native birds? <laughs> No, no, this way he would be native to Central and South America, although a lot of people have them as pets. And since we are a rescue, that's how we got him. He was unable to be cared for by his owner and she was uh, asking if the zoo could take him. So we've had him here for about 10 years or so and he's a great uh, ambassador for his species. He loves being out and talking to everybody and being on camera. Miss <laughs> uh, Diane, let's talk about the celebration because this is so great that you guys have been able to take care of, as you said, animals that have been either neglected or um, hurt or people can't take care of them. And that's when you guys have stepped in. And, and so for the celebration, what's going to be going on? So our celebration tomorrow is going to be all day long. Our regular uh, hours are going to be nine to five and we're celebrating our 35th anniversary with $3.50 admission for everyone. We're also gonna be having um, uh, concessions so you can get food here at the zoo. We're gonna be having a bounce house. We're gonna be having games and activities. So we're gonna try and do our best to have a great celebration day and the $3.50 admission is, is going to hopefully encourage a lot of people to come visit us. <laughs> I love Miss Diane, I feel like like the, I feel like he's he's uh, mocking you a little bit as you're talking, just kind of like going along. D does he does he speak at all? Does he talk back to you? He does. Ah. He can say a few things. He says hello um, sometimes. Let's see if we can get him to say hello. Ah. What do you say? What do you say? Hello. There we go. So he said hello. He talks a lot of times when no one's around, when no one's listening, but I know he can say hi, Max. He says bye. He says good bird. He says quite a bit. He likes to laugh when people are laughing. So uh, he's quite a ham. I love it. And, and I know also, too, you guys are going to be, of course, having these ambassadors around during the celebration that people can get up close to. Um, but you do ask people when they come in to respect the animals because this is them actually in a sanctuary in a safe place. So really, tomorrow's celebration, come through, see what you guys are doing, right? Yes, we encourage everybody to come. If you've been here before or never have, you know, the Jaguars are new um, to us. We have a, a couple new additions. We have a new uh, reptile house enclosures that were just installed yesterday. So that's a, a great thing to see if you've seen the, the previous ones to come see the upgrades. Um, we have about 200 animals that live here on grounds permanently. And as you said, they're all here because they needed a place to go. They were either orphaned, injured in the wild, um, former pets people couldn't care for like Max. So. Yeah. We have a variety of, of native Arizona animals as well as some exotics that you wouldn't find here in the wild in uh, Arizona. So a lot of animals and like we said, they all needed a place to go and that's yeah. why we're here and we're happy to be a sanctuary to be able to provide homes yeah. for those in need. I we take it. in rescue animals as well every year. Our spring is very busy with baby animals yeah. that are orphaned or displaced. Yeah. And um, so yeah. we just have uh, yeah. provide homes for those room. that that maybe came in from the wild that yeah. couldn't couldn't go back out in the wild. Oh, I love it. Uh, Diane, thank you very much, Miss Diane. We got information on AZTV.com about the celebration heading up there. So you got to go up and do it. So thank you.